Hey there, Taurus. This is Nancy, and welcome to your June 2023 forecast. So there's a lot happening for you this year, Taurus. It's been pretty busy. The North Node has been in your sign for a little over a year, and it's set to leave your sign and move into Aries within a few weeks. And this energy for the collective meant moving towards finding solid ground and being focused on practicality, how we live our lives, our home and surrounding environment, what we value and how we value things. And very shortly, Jupiter, lucky, happy Jupiter is going to be moving into your sign where it's going to be for one full year. But before we get into that, let's talk about the part of your chart that will be illuminated in the beginning of June. So the sun, which lights up wherever it goes, will be transiting your second house of income in the first three weeks of June. So if you have any projects through your work that will result in an increase of income, this would be a very good time to complete it and get it out there into the world. And this would also be a great time to ask for a pay raise or start a new side hustle. On June 17th, the new moon in Gemini will be beginning its new lunar cycle in the sector of your second house of income. And this is a good time to set new intentions and goals relating to your income. A couple of days before or after the 17th, you should write down on a piece of paper everything you want to accomplish and then ask the universe for assistance. By the time the full moon in Gemini takes place in December, six months from now, see what culminates for you. Okay. After the 21st of June, the sun moves into your third house of communication, thinking, learning. And it's also the house of siblings and it rules automobiles. So during this time, you may have your thoughts on taking a class or teaching class. You could be buying a new car or you could be helping a brother or a sister with a challenge. On June 5th, your ruler, which is Venus, is going to be transiting your fourth house of home and family along with Mars until July 10th. This exciting transit is going to be taking place in the fixed sign of Leo. When Venus comes together with Mars, this is normally when we see marriages taking place or other forms of commitment happening in the relationship department. And when it happens in Leo, it's very passionate and fiery. And this is a time when you may be creating a new home with your significant other and you could be purchasing or remodeling. You could also be dealing with other issues at the fourth house, which is about your relatives and your roots. So now let's talk about Jupiter, because I believe that this is the most exciting for you, Taurus. Jupiter will be entering your sign where it will stay for one full year. It'll be transiting your first house of self. Jupiter is expansive and benevolent. It's lucky. It brings joy and it brings wealth and abundance. And this year and leading into mid 2024, it would be a great time to focus on your self image, taking care of yourself and working on yourself. Maybe there's a new workout program that you've been wanting to try. So just go for it. A new class that you want to take, just do it. And maybe there's a new hairstyle or a new clothes that you want to buy. Try it. And this is about you and your reinvention. You're going to be supported by Jupiter right now. So take a chance. If there's a school or a job or anything else that you think may be out of your reach, just apply for it anyways. You might be pleasantly surprised. And finally, Jupiter in your first house is going to be making a sextile to Saturn, which is retrograding in your 11th house of friendship, community, and financial gains. So just having Saturn retrograding alone in Pisces in your 11th house would be a challenge. But since Jupiter is making a harmonious aspect to this house, you can bet that some good news will be coming out of that part of your chart. Okay. All right, Taurus. Well, this is what I have for you for the month of June. It's going to be very exciting for you. All right. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye.